Take your pick. You'll find no second-rate items at Wagner's. There are leaves around. And I know just the... Time to go. <laughs> Add Astra Abyssosk. What can I do for you, traveler? Ah, yes. I've heard that you've already made arrangements with the captain of the Crux Fleet regarding your past. Now that I think about it, it's been quite some time since I last visited those lands. There you are. You're the traveler that Beido will be taking to Inazuma, right? The fleet is nearly completed reprovisioning. Once the crews have taken... Captain Beto sent me to come get you. We'll weigh anchor as... Seems Beto is the captain of our word. Of course. There are many things that the captain insists upon. I'm sure you'll see for yourself once you're... So you'll be heading off then? I suppose congratulations are... Whether the journey before you leads to the heights of the heavens or the depths of the abyss, until we meet again, Ad Astra Abyssosk. to say goodbye now. <laughs> well, if that's how you feel, why not come and find me when you arrive? I'll be awaiting you in Narukami. So there's another Catherine in Inazuma? See? <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess it's time for you to bid farewell to Liyue Harbor. Now that I've delivered my message, I'll be heading back. Okay, thanks for coming all this way to let us know. Just following orders. I'll... to the wind. Huh. One with nature. Huh. 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 The wind knows me. You finally made it. All these years, come rain or storm, the Crux fleet has never suffered a delay. <laughs> Don't look too serious, I'm only joking. You're just... 
Well, now that everyone... We set sail for the land engulfed by storm and tempest. The nation of eternity. Acres away! Ahoy there. So, you finally made it. You sure kept me waiting, Captain. And it appears we have a couple of stowaways. Or perhaps I should say... You can blame your almighty Shogun. The tempests around Inazuma have been growing all the more fear. Though the fleet was fully up to the challenge, the inclement weather still caused some delay. Now then, let me introduce everyone. This is Toma, a trade partner. <laughs> you don't know how long I've been waiting to- Toma, these two are- oh, No need for introductions. Their reputation precedes them. It seems even the stormy seas can't keep rumors of these outlanders- <laughs> Oh, it's- <laughs> With any luck, Toma's resided on Rito for quite some time now. It wouldn't be going too far to say he- If you run into any problems here, just talk to Toma. But if he tries to pull any moves on you... <laughs> no need to worry. I'm sure we'll get along. Good. Then if it's all settled, I'll be going. I wouldn't want to be caught with my sails down here. Oh, right. Kazuha. Until next time, Traveler. Remember to give it your all, no matter what peril... Now then. First things first, we need to go get you registered. Um, Paimon thought we were supposed to be keeping things on the- <laughs> Don't underestimate the reaches of the Sokoku Decree. You wouldn't be able to avoid- So we have to play by the rules, even if we're kind of bending them. Hello? Please state your name, identity, and the purpose of your visit. Oh, you must be... new here. Uh -huh. Excuse me? Please provide the information requested, and also declare any goods you are carrying with you. Oh, well, I'm sorry. We cannot approve entry for purely personal reasons. Uh, um... My apologies, but I'll have to ask you to... 
Here are their entry papers for your kind perusal. What? <laughs> I just wanted to see what. I see. Okay. Your papers are all. <sighs> so. The Outlander Affairs Agency. Uh, they only check entry permits here. If you want to remain on retail. Sheesh. So we. Well, let's not forget that to everyday folk in Inazuma, people from. As the word suggests. Outlanders aren't very welcome in Inazuma with the Sokoku. Not even on Rito, where they've established an outsider settlement. <laughs> I like how you think. I've got a feeling. Now, let's head over to the Outlander. Most of the current rules were put in place by the administration of Rito, the Kanjo Commission. Yes, one branch of the Tri Commission of Inazuma, responsible for growing and managing the nation's wealth. Um, you really haven't heard of it? You've completed the entry procedures, yes? And now you want to- Yes, please. Okay, the processing fee will be two million- Two million? For a processing- That's right. One million per applicant, which makes two million total. Paimon wasn't so much questioning your math and- <laughs> Ma'am, these two here are good- Ah, Mr. Toma, it's you. By way of courtesy, allow me to reduce it to- <laughs> Thank you- but as this is just a processing fee, I think 600 mora should cover it if I'm paying on their behalf. I'll treat you to- That's not how you haggle! By all means, bargain- Alright then, as you wish, Mr. Toma. <laughs> Much obliged. Wrong with people's sense of finance around here! <laughs> it's not as mind-boggling as you think. Processing fee is just... The way some here at the agency see it, the fees are easy money. So it becomes a question. So when the day comes that some poor merchant from overseas with more money than cents gets stuck here... Then they'll milk them for all their worth! <laughs> exactly. It's at times like this that having a local friend really comes in handy. Yes, but when you're an outlander in Inazuma, far from home in this close nation era, the most that overseas merchants can do to look after themselves, that's how the International Trade Association... So it's a trade association built by and for... Yep. And as well as advancing commercial interests, the association provides... Essentially, it's an association devoted to both commercial excellence and survival skills. <sighs> Sounds like just staying alive is an achievement when you... I see. So this is the real purpose of your trip. Yes, given that you are Outlander, after all, the Raiden Shogun is the most exalted and revered one in all of e- Huh. I was going to say nothing is set in stone when it comes to who you will encounter in this world. Who's to say you won't happen to run into the Raiden Shogun? Uh-huh. Okay, I'll give it to you straight. I know- Really? Wow! The <laughs> 
I mean, it will take all the resources I have at my disposal, but it, connections come at a high price. Ugh, not you. <laughs> no, no. In this, in, in fact, there's no real cost as such. It's just that if this is something you really want, I like to do things in a way that keeps everybody happy. Sounds very reasonable to Paimon. You're the man in the middle, so you have to trade favors to keep every- <laughs> Why do I get the feeling you're making me out to be some sort of crook? Uh, never mind. Here's the situation. As I touched upon earlier, the members of the International Trade Recently, things seem to have gotten more difficult than ever for them, so just go and check things out. See if there's any way you can help. The head of the association is called Carisio, and he's a good friend of mine. Time to go. You must be seeking refuge with the International Trade- Ah, good. That's a relief. <sighs> you need to be careful, or you'll find yourself losing your- We heard the association has been happy. Yes. Left, right, and center- The Sakoku Decree certainly makes things diff- But it's not the root cause of our woes. The Sakoku Decree might restrict our scope of activity, but- No. What's really squeezing us out like those Mora Grubbers from the Kanjo Commission. Oh, of the three commissions, that's the one that oversees everything on retail, isn't it? That's right. They impose astronomical tax rate, unbelievable regulations, and that's not the worst of it. They just issued a new tax decree recently that, for some reason, completely changes the way we pay our taxes. It used to be Mora, but not- Crystal Marrow. What's that? Uh, something that most of us in the association had never heard. Eventually, one of the older Liyue merchants recalled that he once shipped a batch of it to Snezhnaya in his youth. So, in order to pay our taxes, we began an arduous search for this crisp. But then we found we'd only managed to create a bigger problem for ourselves. The r uh, Now there's only one vendor who even has it in stock. Uh, isn't that what they call a... Exactly. So this vendor keeps pushing the price up, and we have no choice but to buy from- It's a vicious cycle. The consequence of which is that our taxes will- <sighs> We've tried communicating with the commission directly, but this is a nation where the cries of a few struggling merchants will never be heard over the ever-present roar of thunder. Ah, <sighs> Fontaine, my dear homeland. I miss you an awful lot at the moment. Bleeding them dry. What do you think we should do? Uh, that Ven. I've actually done business with him in the past, but after a point, he stopped contacting us. Hmm. Well, it definitely sounds like he's being unfair. Hey, that's a pretty good idea. Since you're not affiliated with the. If I remember correctly, our usual meeting point with him is under a tree by the coast in the residential district. See if you can find him. Got it! We're on the case! Bless you. 
Oh. I don't think I recognize you. Are you new arrivals? So, what do you need with me? The sheer nerve. You don't go around asking questions like that. If trade secret, got it? You know what trade and... This guy's got a bad attitude. Ha! <laughs> Are you even buying? Oh, I... <laughs> They're wasting their time. The price is not... Hey, what's your... Pr Get out of here. Go on. Tell them they're lucky to be buying from me in the first place. And they ought to be more grateful. What are we gonna do? There's no talking to this guy. Good idea. Let's... Into the wind! <laughs> mm hmm That was quick. Um, actually, we're having a little trouble. Oh? Well, by all means, tell me what- Getting you to go fixing things when you've only- Oh, that guy? Um, he used to be a bit of a sorry sight, selling shells that he collect on the beach just to get by, but I can only assume he must have found himself a patron after leaving the International Trade Association. Huh. You're saying he used to be a member of the- Yes. Couldn't you tell when you spoke to him? That's right. Werner was born in Mondstadt, then went into the shipping business, trading between Leah and Inazuma. When Inazuma closed to the outside world, he was one of a group of outlanders that ended up stra- huh. The International Trade Association was initially very generous to him, but over time, with decree after decree... So he left the association? <laughs> I'm sure it's more nuanced than that. I believe even the most ungrate... Really? Is that a... Well then, it sounds like you may have found a way... Ready, outlandish. <laughs> Strike! What are you doing back here? Just cause I got plenty of time on my hands doesn't mean I want to waste any of it talking to you. Huh? Where is this coming from? Mondstadt? You were talking about... Goodness, I can sense it now. So familiar, but I can't remember the last time I was there. Ah, <sighs> the scent of Mondstadt. Oh, how it takes me back. Ah, oh, my hometown. The home of freedom. Oh, it's working! <sighs> oh, oh, oh <clears throat> So, trying- Huh? What is this? Wh Just close your eyes already! You mean, the sound of the ocean? Leah Harbor. I can see it so clearly. Uh, oh, and the sound of the waves, the calls of the merchants, Xiao Lanterns. <laughs> this guy has a really active imagination. Either that. <sighs> Wait. Stop. That's enough. Don't make me relive it anymore. My poor heart can't take it. You mean, the folks from the International Trade Association? Often, I'll sneak down to the shore at night and listen to the sound of the waves. I've run into folks from the association more than a few times. <sighs> Don't you think I've wanted to talk things through with them and f Um, well, no one stopped? <sighs> They're so resilient. 
None of them had anyone else to rely on, so they rallied together, commit- So, I caved. Those people, they'd make the smallest of promises, offer them- All right, I'll tell you the whole story. It's- You ready to talk now? But I betrayed them. I, I can't- Ah, uh, come on, you scaredy cat. Look, so come on, get it off your chest. It's a scheme by the tax collection Ashigaru. Keiji- They start by overtaxing the merchants, then take the extra crystal marrow they receive and stockpile it. Once the merchants run out of places to buy crystal marrow, they get me to sell that extra stock back to the merchants at an extortionate price, with the proceeds going to the t It's just... it's- I'm their puppet, yes. But my cut is a tiny fraction of what we take in total. Evidence? Hmm... You now that I think about it, whenever I report back to him after a sale, he always heads to the same- As it happens, I handed some Mora over to him not long ago. I- Really? Well then- Time to go! Check. Keijiro! It's him! After him! Should I close early? It's not like I'll get any customers. Ah, rip. Too close! That's too close! He'll notice us for sure! He's getting further and further away! Let's catch up a little! Now, who else is behind on payments? Should I close Let me think. Yes, the trade association click still needs to be brought into line. He's getting further and further away! Hmm. What was that sound? Must be hearing things. Uh, drat, I'm behind schedule. I need to hurry. He's getting further and further away! Let's catch up a little! Huh? Where'd he go? He was right there a moment ago. Seems he disappeared in a blink of an eye! If only we'd made less noise! Time to go. Should I close early? It's not like I'll get any customers. Kajiro! After him! Love or freedom? Which one should I choose? Ah, Ryoko, how's business? <laughs> All the better thanks to your generous patronage. Good! Thankfully, I earn plenty these days. Oh, but of course, tax collection is difficult work. Now, who else is behind? Too close! That's too close! You'll notice this for sure! What was that sound? Shh! Quiet! Don't let him find us! Must be hearing things. Ah, drat! I'm behind schedule. I need to hurry.
What could he be doing at a place like this? It looked like he buried something over there, didn't it? What? Let me take a look here. Aha, uh -huh, yes! This is what we're looking for. Great! Well, now we have our heart. Uh, um. Huh? You want. I. I need a little more time. Huh. Poor wood. But we really don't have anything left. If this keeps up, our sales will come in at a loss. There'll be nothing left for us to do but starve. You know the decree. The rules are the rules. No discounts, no exceptions, and no excuses. Hmm? And who are you? Another new member of the association? It just so happens that we found your little ledger. So now we're here to tell everyone all about how you embezzled Crystal Huh? Is this true? You've been swindling us! Well, uh, you, you, you see... The Let me take a look at the ledger. Well, would you look at that? Every payment the associate... So, Mr. Keijiro, it seems you have some expla... <laughs> so you think you can use this against me, do you? It's quite Word has it that Samurai and the Commission place great importance on reputation and prestige. The huh? Is that a threat? Are you- No, not at all. I'm simply stating that it would be quite a pity if an illustrious- uh, Well, even if what you say is true- I believe you still have a quantity of crystal marrow in your possession. Perhaps that crystal marrow could be used as compensation for the recent tax hike, and us merchants could find- Is that- Oh, do you have any idea the hoops I had to jump through to get the crystal marrow and keep it hidden? And not even an ounce of sh So that's it? My shop's been closed for weeks now. I've even had to ask my friends to help bail me out. What about my loss? Come on, Harrison. We've already struck a good deal here. I'm sick of being pushed around like this. Harrison. Hey, what's all this racket? Does someone dare question the- Ah, Chief. You've arrived. What was all the commotion I heard just now? Oh, we were just discussing a minor tax issue. I do my utmost. A helping hand? The only thing you're doing is stuffing your greedy pockets with our hard-earned wealth. I assure you that Hiragi- Oh, and you dare to utter the Commissioner's name. You outlanders have no respect for the- Seize the merchants! We will resolve this dispute back at headquarters. Uh -oh. Going in a gentlemen, gentlemen, come now. Is there any need for this? Who are you supposed to be? And why in my... Ha! You never heard of the Fixer? Here's my card. Huh. You're from the Yashiro Commission. Shh. Huh. Well, this is Kanjo Commission territory. However powerful the Yashiro Commission may be, you have no business meddle- <laughs> Of course not, of course not. Still, perhaps you could show the young la- ...of our clan some courtesy. You wouldn't want your name showing up in a petition to the Shogun, would you? That fan. The Shirasagi Himegimi. I don't need any trouble with her. <sighs> okay. But, Chief! Enough! We're leaving! Let's get dinner one day soon, gentlemen! My treat, I insist! Uh, no response, huh? I suppose that bridge is well and truly bur- Thank you so much, Toma. But I'm sorry your relationship with the- <laughs> Hey, hey, I was joking. It's a small price to pay, and you're more than welcome. If there's anyone you should be thanking, it's the Traveler. She- <sighs> If nothing else, I'm sure the tax collection Ashigaru will tread a little- 
Shh, shh, not here. Too many people listening. <laughs> It's tyranny. Plain and blessing now ten percent off. Corruption seems rife in the Kanjo Commission. They truly are rotten to the All right. It's time for me to answer your questions. What would you like to know? <laughs> Straight to the point. I belong to the Kamisato clan of the Yashiro Commission on Narukami Island. Keeping your true I So, the Yashiro Commission. Guessing that's- Correct. The Kamisato clan is the head of the Yashiro Commission. Who managed their- I'm just someone who was fortunate enough to be taken in by the Kamisato clan. My role is to take care of the daughter of the clan, Kamisato Aya- Seems like she must be super famous in Ina- <laughs> Oh, most definitely. She's graceful, dignified. Her fame even somewhat eclipses that of her older brother, Kami- I suppose those who treat others with compassion earn themselves the same treatment in return. Miss Kamisato's situation certainly seems to attest to that. Take me! You're asking the right questions. And to be honest, I don't want to keep you in the dark. Firstly, you should know that being a fixer is not something you can fake. I spent the better part of a month tirelessly building up a network of relationships on the island. Still pretty good going for just a month. <laughs> well, maybe I have a slight knack for schmoozery. But the main thing was... Inazuma may have closed off to the outside world, but that hasn't stopped a lot of people. So, when Miss Kamisato heard of your intention to come to Inazuma, she began looking forward to your arrival with great anticipation. That is, that you have what it takes to change the tide of the times. Change the tide of the time? In the test I gave you earlier, although there were a few hiccups at the end, it was you who navigating powerful people, using their character flaws to your advantage. It's just what Miss Kami's with your help, even the Vision Hunt decree. Ah, uh, hmm. That's an unexpected development. Perhaps, yes, of course. I completely understand and. Huh. Toma sure didn't. <laughs> well. My work on Rito is done, so I suppose this is goodbye for now. Oh, uh, one more thing. This invitation letter is for you. When you get to Nar- Good luck with everything. See you soon. Thomas, not such a bad guy, huh? 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 What's up? Oh, right! Wait, so... Did Toma forget that too? Oh, darn it! Nope! As soon as we get off Ritu, Paimon's going straight to Kamu- <sighs> Well, guess we should give it a try- Documents and proof of identification ready. Strider! Stop there! Present your travel per- Sorry, but we really gotta get to Narukami- If you don't have a travel permit, this is as far as you'll get. Ah, uh, as ex- Traveler, you gotta think of something! How do we get out of Rito? Are you saying we should go and meet with the Kanjo Commission? Guess it can't hurt to try! Wind knows me.
Halt! This is the Kanjo Commissioner's office. No trespassers. We're here to see, uh... The Kanjo Commissioner seldom entertains outlanders. Leave now or we'll be forced to... Ah, wait, wait, wait. Oh, Commissioner! These two are honored guests from afar. No need to give them the you. Hmm, come on in. Let's see what- Huh! Did you get all that? M m my sincere apology. I am Hiragi Shinsuke, Kanjo Commissioner and Head. Nice to meet you, sir. So, the reason we wanted to- All right, all right, all in good time. Two travelers renowned far and wide have shown up to see- <laughs> So what you're saying is- we Absolutely. How many other people in the world have what it takes to knock the wind out of sto- Exactly! Pine up and- I hear you also foiled a Fatui plot in Liyue Harbor. Even beat one of their- Whoa! You heard about that t- Hmm... As I- Something wrong? <laughs> no, no, no. I'm simply awestruck by you both is all. Rito is greatly honored to- One other thing I heard about you is your great zeal for helping other people. Oh, sure! No problem! Whatever you need, right? Excellent. You must know the Qingxin. A flower. Yep, we've picked a few of those before. So, uh... Yes, bring me 300 Qingxin, would you? Uh, did Paimon hear that wrong? Hmm? Too much trouble. Then how about this? We have a few items that need delivering. That sounds much more... 709 letter. Terribly sorry. We're just a little short on people lately. What sort of an explanation is that? Traveler, what are we going to do? Should we really help this guy? That's the spirit. Don't keep me waiting too long now. You're seriously considering taking this job? The terms are ridiculous. One with nature. Follow the wind.
The wind knows me. Halt, you two! Huh? What Miss Hiragi has a letter for you. She insists that you read it in- A letter? Quick! Let Paimon see! So this means... She wants you to, but you didn't seem surprised at all by this. What's going on? Huh? Have you? This scenery is wonderful. Surely enough to convince anyone to become a wanderer. <laughs> ah, you finally arrived. Allow me to introduce myself. This is technically the second time we have met. The Hiragi clan, all right. Uh, no need to be so formal. I've long marveled at your accomplishments. Is it Paimon or does some... The reason why I wanted to secretly meet you here is... Well... Discuss what? Ahem. I should like to ask for your help with... Delivering a letter. Ugh. Like father, like daughter. Uh, no. You misunderstand me. I was hoping that you could deliver a letter to Narukami Island in my stead. It is to be given to Kujo Kamachi. My father has always forbidden me from communicating with him. He knows that there are prospects for my marriage that would better serve him politically. <sighs> there is no one who would dare defy my father's will on Rito, but you are outlanders. Outlanders seeking to get to Narukami Island. Oh, of course, in doing so, I will also do everything in my power to help you leave Rito. That is my promise. To be perfectly honest, as long as you remain in Inazuma, my father will have no- Yeah, we figured as much. It was pretty obvious he was just trying to- I secretly overheard a conversation between my father and a- v They seemed to be discussing how to keep you here on Rito. In fact, it was the first time I had ever heard my father speak so- We don't have much time. I'll tell you my plans to help you off- Very well. I'll be waiting for you at the border. I'm counting on you to deliver my letter. <laughs> Into the wind! Hold on, please. These goods are being sent to Watatsumi Island. My lady, this is an unexpected honor. Uh, you are correct. These goods have been repeatedly requested by the Kanji. Is there something wrong, Lady Hiragi? No, as you were. My father simply has some concerns of the shipment's safety and has ordered that my. My lady, you aren't suggesting that you intend to escort this shipment personally, are you? There's certainly no need for you to trouble yourself with such. Please, do not cause us any further delay. If memory serves me right, my father has already- Yes, of course, my lady. It, it's just that- Now, need I remind you of the penalty? If anything were to- Do you really presume that you can fully guarantee- Boy, Chisato can talk the talk! Uh, uh yes, my lady. Very well, then. It, it's an honor to have- Shinojo, 
You can't really be agreeing. Well, the request is from Lady Hiragi herself. It is... Yes, but that's not the... Well then, if we're through here, I suggest we set off at once. Dawdle... Yes, my lady. You... My lady, please stay back. We'll handle it. Not as well as we'll handle it! Boba, get them! I'm going in! Such a pain. Teamwork is chamber. Fallen leaves adorn my knights. Run with nature. Monster sighted. Prepare to counterattack. Protect Lady Hiraki at all costs. We'll take care of this. Stay with Chisato. Into the wind! Watch out! More monsters inbound! Lady Hiraki, stay close! Everybody stand back! Now steady as stone! The wind knows the fairy. Add the frying pan into the fire. Just fallen leaves adorn my night. You win. We can take refuge in the village up ahead. How are you faring, my lady? I'm perfectly all right. You may... In my letter, I've requested Kamaji... My lady? Huh. So that's how it is. I... No, Lady Hiragi would never hide anything from us. I'm sure of it. I'm not afraid to say that... The one you... Shinojo, did you honest... What? No, I, uh... <clears throat> I was just... Clarify... You two needn't worry. Please, forget that this ever happened. If my father catch... Yes, of course. But what will happen if your actions here are... Don't fret. My father has always been one to spoil me. The worst he'd do is sentence me to half a day without food. Or... Huh. Paimon never suspected it. I wish you a safe journey. Bye, Chisato! Come now. Quit your staring and let's get moving. We've got goods to shift. <laughs> uh, all right.